Hey guys, Michael here, and I'm back to talk bricks. Today we're talking LEGO Dimensions and the Powerpuff Girls Team Pack. For the weekly giveaway, simply comment and subscribe and you could win a prize. The Powerpuff Girls Team Pack doesn't come out until September 12th with the rest of Wave 9, but I was lucky enough to get it early thanks to the folks at Warner Brothers. Each Team Pack comes with two minifigures and two vehicles or gadgets. On the left, we've got Blossom and the Powerpuff Girls smartphone, and on the right, Bubbles and Octi. What really sets this team pack off for me are these two great new minifigures. First up, we've got Blossom, and she looks really great with that custom head. She's got the black stripe across the torso, and shoes printed on the short white legs, and the overall sweet smile and wide eyes. From the side here, we get a much better look at the custom head, and it's really enormous but the proportion seems spot on for the Powerpuff Girls. And from the back, we can see the red bow and the red heart detail at the top of the ponytail. And she has that same black stripe on the back. Next up, we've got Bubbles and her overall design is exactly like Blossom, but with light blue highlights. But again, with this minifigure, what makes it so special is that brand new custom head with the blonde pigtail look. From the side, you can see how the eyes wrap around the head. And I think this looks really great. From the back here, we can see the black stripe on the torso, and there's a small X at the top of the head, which adds some nice detail. Each minifigure comes on its unique toy tags, so you can't mix them up. Blossoms and Bubbles are a very simple design featuring the colors of their dresses, but they each feature a fun exclamation at the front, pow and zap. And on to the mini builds. First up, we've got the Powerpuff Girls smartphone, and it has this really fun design that sort of looks like a smartphone on top of an older rotary phone. At the center, we've got a pink flower and this great printed 2x2 tile with that amazing smartphone face. Like I said earlier, the bottom of this design looks like an older rotary phone with a red handset, though this part of the model is removed in game. And here's a quick shot of it from the back. Next up, we've got the build for the Octi, and this build has a fun octopus design with a great light purple and blue color scheme. At the top, we've got the octopus head, which has a great round design, and it features two amazing 2x2 two two rounded tiles with a new print, as well as a blue top hat, though I would prefer if the gray piece at the center was light purple. And at the bottom, this octopus only has four legs, but I really like the way they accomplish this, and each leg is poseable. And here's a quick shot of the back. Each mini build can be rebuilt into three total configurations. From the Octi you can make, the Sonic Squid, and the Super Skunk. And from the PPG smartphone, you can make the PPG Hotline and the Powerpuff Magnet. The Powerpuff Girls Team Pack gives you access to the Townsville Adventure World, as well as a battle arena. The two minifigure designs in this set are just amazing, and the mini builds are pretty fun, especially the Octi, as I love how it walks around in the game. The Powerpuff Girls Team Pack comes out with the rest of Wave 9 on September 12th, and will retail for $24.99. And I definitely recommend picking it up, as all the Wave 9 characters have a ton of abilities, and are a lot of fun. I've got a lot more planned for LEGO Dimensions coming up, so don't forget to subscribe. And again, I wanted to give a huge shout out to Warner Brothers for sending this to me early. Leave me a thumbs up down below if you're excited for Wave 9, and let me know your thoughts in the comments down below to let me know what you think about this pack. And remember, for my weekly giveaways, simply comment and subscribe, and you could win a prize. You must be a subscriber to win, and definitely turn on notifications to find out when my next video is posted, because I'll be announcing the winners at the end of some of the videos. That's all the time we've got for today. Thanks, and have a good one. Hey guys, Michael here. Click here to check out my Teen Titans Go Team Pack review, and don't forget to subscribe 